Hey guys, I'm Nate the Intern, and welcome back to Built by Design. So in this video, we're gonna be learning about the Autodesk tool Showcase, which is a tool designed to create accurate renderings of your 3D models. This is great for marketing purposes, or even just showing off your model at the end of the year. So let's get started. I have a lot of options. I can create a new scene, open a scene, or look at sample scenes. For this video, we're gonna to go to a new scene, go to the More tab, and create an indoor realistic setting. Next, I need to import a model. I'm gonna use the Built by Design robot model for this video. Next, in the conversion settings, I'm gonna use the all purpose setting, click OK. It's then gonna convert. All right, now that's loaded, I can click close. Scroll around a little bit. And now I need to set the ground floor. So right now the ground level isn't quite right. So I'll set the floor position. And I can now adjust that visually to check to make sure that my model is actually sitting on the ground. Now that that's done, I can go to a view. Let's zoom in. I can zoom out using that view cube tool in almost the exact same way that we do in Autodesk Inventor. I can use zoom, tilt, pan, all of these work. Now that I have a decent view of the robot, I can go to Visual Styles Library. I can turn on ray tracing. Once that's done, I can go into settings. Now, this is gonna allow me to set the settings. So I can say ray tracing as good. I can tick create samples per pixel. I can set that to four. And that's gonna give me even a higher quality model. I can then go save image, set the aspect ratio and the number of pixels. There's a lot of options here that I can choose. So we'll go up, that's not quite the one I want. There we go. Again, choose good, save image, save it as, let's say, pick finale, save. And now this will load. And as it renders, we are done. All right, so now that we've rendered one showcase image, it's really easy to render a bunch more. We have applied our visualization settings, it's just a matter of reorienting the model, maybe reorienting the zoom, and now we'll be able to create lots of very interesting and dynamic pictures of our robots. Hopefully this tutorial series will help you submit for the IRS 3D Design Award by allowing you to create those renderings. Until next time, I'm Nate the Intern. This is Built by Design. Good luck out there.